Is there a Gnostic priesthood today? Or the modern Gnostic priesthood? It's either old Gnostic Mandanians or Mandaeans, like these people in the picture in this video, or it's Neo-Gnostics, for example, the guys at Ecclesia Gnostica, for example, people who've got like a website or a Facebook group and they're going to like charge you money to join their secret group so that you can be instructed by them. When Gnosis is supposed to be about self-knowledge, so you don't need a priest to come to God. You've got Jesus. There's one mediator between God and man, the man, Christ Jesus. So we don't need priests. The only surviving old Gnostics are the Mandanians. They branched off from Judaism probably before Jesus. They refer to John the Baptist, not Jesus. The Neo-Gnostics are always Christians that have added some beliefs from what they considered Valentinian scriptures, sometimes Cephian scriptures in the Nag Hammadi library. Among them are a lot of annoying New Age self-elected prophets. They are many branches among the Neo-Gnostics. There are a lot of pseudo-Gnostics or fake Gnostics too. The common trait being that they don't care about the Gnostic scriptures, the Nag Hammadi library or the Mandanians, but instead refer to some self-elected prophet like Alistair Crowley or some guy from Mexico, I can't pronounce his name, but he calls himself Samuel, but he was really born Victor Gomez Rodriguez, I think. None of these people are very helpful at all. They're just a cult and they just want to take your money and give you false knowledge. To be Gnostic means that you claim to have secret knowledge, in other words, knowledge revealed only to you, which you are meant to reveal to the world in your own time and your own way. This is a direct contradiction of ancient Christian belief, which says that public revelation, that is, new knowledge revealed by God for all people, ended with the death of the last apostle, the last person given authority directly by Christ. Thus, a Gnostic priest is not a mystic, but is simply a person who claims to have knowledge from God that no one else has. These people should be avoided for the sake of your soul.